Hello, Joshua Blan. Thank you for tuning once again to One Pinot Chick Chats. Today is Sunday. Yes, today is Sunday, and it's little Molly's birthday. Uh, you know her life story, guys. It's kind of a um, very challenging early life, early days for her. But uh, yeah, she has uh, reached a month old today. It's twenty first. much already I have for my goats and I'm still going because it's another hot day I have to finish early They are a team, these four, the triplets of Melly and little Molly. I'm glad that he's got, he's got friends. And um, I think her legs is fully recovered, so I'm happy. I don't, I don't see any more limping in that side. Hello, Uncle Martin. I'm better now, Uncle Martin. <laughs> Look. Oh. I have my weighing scale ready for Molly's weight. I learned from Instagram that uh, it's World B Day. <laughs> what is it? David Beckham like was into a B blah blah and saying it's a World B Day. Happy World B Day! Yeah, there's so much bees right now, guys. Later, I'm gonna show you something at the uh, above the pollinator where there's a lot of bees really so uh, the durian tree that's near that uh, bee area right now like for the first time has fruited and I'm hoping with this weather it will still be uh, you know it will still mature because that's the thing right now guys the the buds the flowers and or the you know the young fruits just uh, rot because of our weather look at this again thunders and lightning uh, so like well, I'll, I'm just hoping that it will kind of um, uh, develop really into an edible fruit or durian thanks to those bees <laughs> Oh, look how shiny that baby is, little Molly. She's living with Auntie Squeaky, who had like closely similar life with her, kind of orphan, and no milk from day two. So yeah, I think um, I just assumed that uh, Squeaky would like give her the understanding, the patience that she needs. Does she have the same experience? Okay, baby. Isa knows her room, so. Come on now, Rocky! Rock! Is that your mama, baby? It's five o'clock somewhere. Well, the rain is not even here. It's starting to be get misty, but like clouds 
they're not moving at all or maybe it's moving but slight <laughs> so slow so let's get to the guide and our little girl little moldy i'm so happy guys because like she only gets um one or two bottles a day from isa and she is 7.7 .7 kilograms happy guys for a month old and um yeah she's heavier than uh lily and lilith because they like lily at one month is seven kilograms and um uh 6.4 is the weight of lilith and then also um brown sugar and um no brown sugar is uh 7.8 yeah he's a bit heavier and black betty is seven Oh no, 6.5. So like, wow, little Molly having uh, being bottle fed is heavier than those two. So I'm happy. Like I assume that I'm doing it right, <laughs> raising her as an orphan. So right now she's with um Squeaky, and I think being kind of an orphan growing up herself, Squeaky is taking care of her. Like they sleep together, and I'm just so glad. It's working okay for these two so guys this is the thing I told you my pollinator lantana and the bees are here they are moving slowly so slowly in that um, area over there I'm not sure if you can see but yeah they are they and the house is kind of um, here this thick area here yeah. and the doyan that I was talking about is here near the creek like it has so much it had so much flowers when it was on flowering stage and budding stage but then like with the rains with all those rains only few are left like this here these two here, this in the center, and this little bud, and plus, then da da da, pack that one, and the rest have fell down. Not sure if up there. Let's see. It flowered on top, but I don't see anything. <laughs> I think it. This will be like the other tree at the. Uh, fruit area at the back where only one succeeded and it was the first time also to fruit and I was the one who ate it <laughs> with joy yeah so like hopefully as a first timer I mean it's the second time that it flowered but last time it got caught in rain and nothing has uh, nothing was left it all like fell down like this ones see this guy with all the rains it just become like this little doyan yeah so see the others are, have dried little doyan Oink. yeah the rest have not uh, the, these are still small doyan so it's nothing there this one and that other one at the back so uh, right now with all the bees that are are building their how you call honeycomb whatever in my madre de agua area so here that's the only bee area at the moment and um yeah it kind of help our durian <laughs> to uh, pollinate and uh, fruit like that hopefully the rain will spare it at the back, there are six trees that are fruiting. Durian trees that are fruiting at the moment. So, hopefully we get to um, harvest something from there. And enjoy again the, hmm, the goodness of durian. Well, for those who like it only. <laughs> so, this is for now, guys. Thank you for watching. The next um, baby or kid that we're going to weigh is the rock do you think he's gonna be our new record holder in the farm i'm hoping 
Last time it was some um, Romeo. The, our record holder here is Romeo from um, Melly. Those, those were twins, uh, Romeo and Juliet. And then she kind of, uh, Melly uh, rejected Juliet and just raised Romeo. So I was the mama of Juliet at the time. Like, it was a hard life for her also, but um, yeah, she survived and she was a smart girl. She is a lucky girl, she have me. <laughs> yeah, so hopefully we have, we would have a new record holder in the farm. The Rock, hopefully. What do you think guys? Is he gonna be a new record holder in the farm? We'll see. Thanks for watching. This has been One Pinochick Chats. I hope you all had a great Sunday. Bye.